this is what we call in academic terms an economically distressed environment uh, where high rates of concentrated poverty uh, and a range of other kinds of social ills uh, in terms of gang activity, drug dealing and the like. Um, and the reason that uh, it's so important to erect this school and facility in this community is because uh, we want to create uh, an environment uh, where the kids in this community have a quote-unquote safe haven uh, uh, to not only attend school but also to engage in a range of other kinds of social and economic uh, activities and cultural activities that will broaden their horizons. The architect uh, and uh, the developer here uh, uh, did a fantastic job. They, they didn't miss anything in terms of how do you want to develop a world-class facility uh, that has all of the built-in safety mechanisms. We have a world-class industrial-sized kitchen to teach healthy cooking to parents uh, in the community as well. It does no good to just serve healthy meals at lunch hour if kids go home and are eating unhealthy stuff for breakfast or for lunch, although we will provide breakfast, uh, lunch, and two snacks here every day. But you want, this is about transforming families as much as it is to kids. So this is an industrial sized kitchen with the latest technology and we will be teaching healthy cooking here. This is our fitness center uh, that will be equipped with state-of-the-art equipment, and uh, we've entered a relationship with the Department of uh, Physical Education and Recreation at uh, North Carolina Central University. Um, I think uh, the thing about the gym is, is that it's really uh, a multi-purpose facility, uh, not only for athletics, but also for a range of sort of community kinds of activities. This facility uh, will really be a community facility open for a whole range of different kinds of activities including our uh, midnight basketball league that we're going to bring back for disconnected youth. Uh, we have our own facility so we can do it here. It's the initiation of a community change process that says uh, this community is important, we value it, uh, we value the kids who grow up here, uh, and uh, it sends a message uh, to the larger communities that uh, given the, the highly volatile economic climate we find ourselves in, it's still important for us to invest in kids and to invest in our communities. At the end of the day, Durham and the Research Triangle will be a much more attractive place to live and do business based on um, this kind of uh, initiative that we've launched here in Northeast Central Durham.